He says that it was a very dark time for him. Because Translating he for his father, Eric Ale says his father, Caesar, felt hopeless. He battled coronary artery and fatty liver disease for five years. Other transplant centers turned him away. When he first was diagnosed, the only option for him was medical treatments. That's when he went to the TGH Transplant Institute. He when, spent 15 um, months on the transplant waiting work? list and in the hospital working? until his surgery. He still uh, finds it hard to believe that in you know the darkest hours of, of a family's life, uh, they're willing to, to give the, the gift of life. Because of Caesar's religious beliefs, he could not accept a blood transfusion. Surgeons at TGH and USF Health still agreed to take on his case. We have to be extra confident in our skills, extra precise with uh, with the stitch work and, um, and at the same time move fast. In May, they successfully performed the world's first bloodless heart liver transplant. Today, the doctors involved speaking about this historic moment. We had to coordinate not only the recovery of the organs and the preservation of the organs, but the decision making around such a complicated procedure in the context of not using blood products. Giving Caesar a new lease on life, one that he's very grateful for. He feels better than he has in years. He's very, very grateful for everything that has been done for him here. And not only is Caesar grateful for the doctors and team at TGH, he hopes to one day meet the family of the donor to thank them.